Oh, now then, my friends, good morning. Yes, I am back on the island of Tenerife, and I'm right here in Las Americas, actually outside the Sol Hotel, the Sol Tenerife. And for many of you, this is where it all began. Lots of you subscribed to me from Tenerife. Now, if you're new to the channel and you think, I don't even know who this guy is, well, I am the Mac Master, and do think about subscribing because there's lots of great content coming your way. Now, if you've been watching the channel, you know, I've been away for a few days. I've been on holiday, taking a bit of a break because I've not been 100% and I've not been overly well. And I figured, do you know what? It's my last day and I owe it to my subscribers and my family out there, my friends out there, as I call everybody, to take you with me on a little tour. Because if you cast your mind back, one of the most popular videos that I did was a one euro pint. The search for a one euro pint and a cheap breakfast as well. And I got up this morning and I thought, I wonder whether they still do a one euro pint and a cheap breakfast. So I thought I'll have a wander up and down the promenade. And then I figured, well, it's not gonna hurt if I take you with me. So I'm gonna take you with me today. I haven't got a microphone. I haven't got a tripod. I'm literally propping my uh, phone up here. Uh, on two pebbles from the beach there, which I will put back, Tenerife Tourist Board, and uh, I'm going to take you guys with me. It's going to be a bit of fun, it's a lovely day, the sun's coming out, and I'm just going to have a leisurely stroll. There'll be no jumping over cameras today, but it still will be fun, so give it a thumbs up if you like the video, and without further ado, my friends, let's go! So that's the, uh, the Royal Garden there. Don't you just love it when they have a menu and they actually do a little sticker and they just write the price on it. So you know they've actually put the price up. Get the menus reprinted. God blimey, that makes me think that. Come on, onwards my friends. Fillet steak there, 11 euros 90. What do you reckon? Has it gone up in the last few weeks or months? Comments down below. Right, so we've got the famous drop in here. Question is, can we get a one euro pint? One euro fifty? I don't think so. We need a euro or less, 99 cent. Come on, onwards. Right, so here we are, the world famous. I don't know whether it's world famous, but we've got the Bora Bora, which I've been to before, and 
they still do a one euro pint. Check it out. There you go, and breakfast served from 10 until 1 p.m. Uh, it's only 20 past nine at the moment, so I am a little early. However, you can have two fried egg, uh, or two scrambled eggs. You can have uh, two sausages, British bacon, beans, mushroom, grilled tomatoes, hash brown. That's controversial whether it belongs on there or not. It's American, isn't it? Well, hmm, we'll see. Uh, toast and orange juice for three euros 50. I'm saying, that's pretty good, especially if you can have a one euro pint with it. Come on, onwards. There you go, right next door as well. Getting each of this business there, another one euro pint. See, if I was him, I'd put that down to 95 cents or something and get him in. Come on, come on. neck I said give me a break I've not been well what are you doing down there I actually love this part this is one of my favorite parts I have to say because you've got the boats on one side Porto Colon and then you've got the beach on the other it's fantastic come on just take a look oh it's getting too old for this I don't think so. You work it out. If you're here for like two weeks, all them 50 sensors mount up, don't they? That's probably another few pints. Come on, onwards.
Right, seems a bit more expensive down here, doesn't it? One euro fifty for a pint, so I'm going to head back, I think, towards Bora Bora, and uh, let's go and check that out, shall we? Come on, onwards. A little bit of merch there. Get them in the merch store. Down below. Shameless promotion. Come on, onwards. I can't believe it, Bora Bora is closed. However, um, next door, uh, and I'm gonna pr pronounce this uh, wrong, <laughs> Los Fogones, Los Fogones Tapas Place. They do a one euro pint. Uh, they also do a cheap breakfast as well. However, that's not where I'm gonna go today. Uh, I'm gonna meet up with the crack master. I was gonna go to Bora Bora, but a bit of a disappointment. I'm sure I saw them open the other day. If you know whether they're still open, pop it in the comments section down below. I'm gonna head up towards the cozy cafe. We're gonna meet up with the crack master and we're gonna have a breakfast there and we'll check that one out. So don't go anywhere. Right, so we're gonna go to the cozy cafe and they do an all day breakfast and they also do a pint as well. I don't know the price yet. However, we're gonna go and see Daniel, the crack master first at Tenerife, first excursions. Let's go and surprise him. Hello, mate. Don't take, she's hiding. You're hiding. <laughs> Say, if you want an excursion, Come to Tenerife first, first excursion. excursion. Can you do that? If you want one, if you want the best excursions, come to Tenerife first excursions. Come and see us here, and we will look after you. There you go. Thank you very much, Steve. And down, whoops, nearly, okay. nearly breaking my neck there. And in here, we've got. <laughs> there you go. Look, you wanted to see the Night Strider and the Mac Master there again. There you go. It's on the TV there. Yeah, the <laughs> Unflattering view of all of us that of you can ever our... get, like literally from the belly. <laughs> it's my belly that's the yeah, worst. At least, at least that's gone now. That so was, that was one of the best excursions I've done. Just, time. just coming outside for one yeah, minute. Yeah, come outside. So here he is, the crack. What's the? Do I, have I shrunk or have you grown? What's the crack? You all right? So. Yeah, <laughs> he is the crack master. <laughs> so if you're coming to Tenerife, I want the cheesiest commercial ever, right? So if you're coming to Tenerife, tell me what excursions you do. If you're coming to Tenerife, you've got to cut. This is going to be really cheesy, and I guarantee, just to let you know, I guarantee Tenerife on cover take this out of it, right? You can't go. On. Okay, so <laughs> if you're coming to Tenerife, the best. The one and only top excursion that you should do is definitely go out and see the pilot whales. They live between here and La Gomera. Well worth seeing. Absolutely beautiful in their natural habitat. And we do it with all different ranges Can of I just boats. Stop you there. Yeah. We're, we're losing viewers now. Oh, sorry about that, guys. You, well, you do all sorts of excursions, don't oh, yeah. you? Yeah, we do loads of excursions. You do, so, yeah. uh, what do you do? Helicopters, parascending. You do helicopters, parascending. Island tours, other island tours, stargazing. Jet skis. Everything. Jet skis. Jet skis, ski jets. And it is the best excursion company in the world <laughs> it is <laughs> actually there you go endorsed by the mac master no other excursion company on this island would i endorse this is the guy to come and see the others are rubbish yeah well no they're all the other ones are, the other ones are good as well i don't want to slay anyone else's companies like you know <laughs> Getting him in trouble. <laughs> yeah. Anyway, we're off to the cozy cafe. Yeah. Uh, and uh, we're going to have a breakfast there. Yeah, I'm you're going to have a breakfast. I'm going to have a breakfast, yeah. yeah and uh, going to have a pint as well because Bora Bora was closed and we we're looking for dirt cheap breakfast and one euro pints. I don't think that we're going to get that oh, in the yeah, cozy yeah, cafe. No. However, it will be better quality. So. Yeah, it'll be good quality. Yeah. So we'll see you there. Come and see this guy, D Daniel, the crack master. That's my name. Or Kim. <laughs> or Kim. Come and see Kim. Come and see Kim, actually. Yeah, she's wonderful. Sorry, oh, I wasn't leaving you out. That's all right, don't worry, mate. I'm look, look, at her, look at her glasses. They even match her T-shirt. Yeah. They're, oh, there you are. So like, one more time, come and see Kim. She's here. Uh, actually, she's <laughs> lovely. Uh, really lovely. So come and see Kim. And I'll see you guys in a minute.
Right, so we're going to order a breakfast. Okay, we're going to go. Sir, we're when going are you to go, ready? We're going to go for the large breakfast, okay, I think. Okay, a large normal. Yeah, uh, a large, yeah, just a large normal English breakfast, which is five yeah, euros yeah. ninety. What's that then? That's two bacon, yeah. uh, two eggs, two sausages, two toast, um, fried or bread and butter. We've got to go for fried bread, haven't oh, we? On holiday. Yeah, it's not yeah. a proper full English without fried, fried bread, bread, is it? Every day of the week. Yeah, it's making me dizzy. <laughs> Look at him with his professional camera work there. Mushrooms. Uh, and tomatoes, we'll go for the uh, the tin Very tomatoes. Well, that'll fill right. a little hole till lunchtime. It will, and then I can mop up the tomatoes with the fried bread, oh, which is what you're supposed to do. About this, and I'll have a you. pint as well, please. But if you could bring the pint out at the same time as the breakfast, that'd be awesome. Fantastic. And I'll have another coffee, yeah. and I'll see you guys in a minute. Hey, <laughs> what are you having? I'm gonna have an orange juice. I'm going mad. You're, you're mad. Oh, I'm mental, me. He's having one <laughs> of his five a day. One of his five a day. friends here we go so we've got the two sausages we've got the uh, tin tomatoes there which is what I like we got the fried bread lots of people say you've got to have fried bread reminds me of being back at my mum's that got uh, wow got, <laughs> got quite a bit of fried bread on there as well uh, oh yeah that brings back memories that does right and we're gonna go in for the eggs no I like them like that not too runny there we go and we're going to go in for the sausage. Here we go. Bit of sausage there. Mm. Nice. We're going to go in for the beans. Yeah, straight away Heinz. Got HP there as well. And ketchup. Might have a bit of both on there in a minute. They are them packets though. And that does my head in. It does me head in. Them packets do me head in. Um, but we'll, we'll go with it. Gonna go in for the hash brown. Controversial. Does it belong on an English breakfast? <laughs> Crack masters behind there thinking, does it really matter, man? <laughs> I like hash brown. And a lot of people saying it's American. But that's not an American hash brown. Totally, totally different. Uh, that you've seen in my American vlogs. Oh, spit in there. Gonna go for in, in for the bacon. Nice bit of bacon there, look. Oh yeah, that's great. Mm. Right, got the pint. Now, this was in a frosty glass, but because we did the photos and the thumbnails out there, it's obviously warm now. Uh, and it, the frost is gone, but cheers guys, I'll see you in a minute. Oh yeah, and by the way, does a pint belong with a breakfast? Comments down below. Right, okay, it's time. It's time. Time. To guess the bill. 
Ooh. Oh, uh, it was actually uh, 16 euros 48. That was for uh, it's a copy of the receipt here. Look, mug of coffee, pint of lager, which was two euros. I know it's not a euro, um, but you know it's a, it's a nicer place. Um, another mug of coffee, two orange juice, and a large breakfast. And the large breakfast was five euros ninety, which I think is pretty good if you work out. That's probably what's that in pounds in English pounds. You're asking the wrong fellow. Asking the wrong. We're asking an Irishman there. You're on the euro, aren't you? Yeah, we're on the euro. Uh, We've been on the euro a while now. Yeah, it's probably a fiver, is it? Something. So yeah, it's pretty good price that. Um, right. So I, it was, I like the three places on the island. I like Lily's tea yeah. rooms. I like Harriet's in Los Cristianos. Yeah. And I like the cosy cafe because the the British English cafes. Yeah. Uh, no offence to the Irish. Yeah. Well, uh, you, you 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 didn't do a great job in Ireland, now with the breakfast. Well, that's my fault. I didn't bring you to the best breakfast. Place. We'll be going back. We'll yeah, go. We'll back. go back. We'll go back. Um, however, um, so I like them three places. I, I wasn't overly keen on the sausage, if I'm honest. They gave you my sausage. You know, one of them, didn't yeah. they? It's a family uh, channel. Behave. Yeah, it's not my. I'm. I'm. But then we have different opinions yeah, on different sausages. Opinions. Any is. Yeah. You like a Ben sausage. <laughs> I like my sausage straight. <laughs> there you go. Anyway, um, I actually like my eggs like that. And I know you're going to say, oh, they're a bit hard. But I don't like runny eggs, to be honest. So I, I'm all right with that. However, some of you might not be. Um, but the produce is very good. And it's a great cafe there as well. They do fish and chips and they do other stuff. So um, how do I mark this one? I go, I, I, it's a different scoring system to, to what I do in the UK or in America and different places. Um, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go. Eight. Okay. Yeah. It's a fair score. Fair enough. Yeah. 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 So yeah. there you go. That's yeah. that's a cozy yeah. cozy cafe. There you go. Yeah. It's a nice little place. Beautiful view as well. Uh, if you sit outside, and then you can come up here, book your excursions with uh, Kim over there. And uh, or Danny, and uh, be, it'll be Kim because Kim does all the work. <laughs> <laughs> She's put the thumb up. So that's Tenerife first excursions. Uh, anyway, I hope you enjoyed that. It was a little video that I did wandering around, having a breakfast, and so you can still get a one euro pint and a, and a dirt cheap breakfast. However, if you want a good breakfast, go to either Lily's go to uh, Harriet's or go to the Cozy Cafe and you'll get a good breakfast. But you can still get a one euro pint. There you go. How about that? How about that? How about that then, eh? Hey? Keep smiling. <laughs> <laughs> right, my friends. That was a little uh, hats off to uh, Jeff Carter there. And I, you can catch him. Uh, Jeff, Jeff, you search him. You'll know who he is. Anyway, I'll see you guys on the next one. You can also subscribe to the Crackmaster as well. There you go. Yeah. And I'll put Tenerife Excursions link in the description down below. And buy one of these shirts, look, Tenerife. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Buy the shirt. Can you get me to the airport? No. Gotta go.